What's up, YouTubers? It's Mushroom. Um, as you can hear, my voice is kind of gone because I've been sick with the flu since last Wednesday. <coughs> so sorry if I'm coughing and whatnot through the video, but I just I came to work today for the first time in a week, and I was really stoked and excited to see that this is uh, this was waiting for me um, on my seat. Uh, this is the new F case just released um, and let's just not waste any time with me talking and let's get to cracking or at least unboxing <laughs> um, let's see sorry guys I'm still a little weak and my head's kind of like all weird and stuff so if I seem a little off today it's because of the damn flu so I apologize um, I'm going to go ahead and move this out of the way just because it's kind of going to get in the way of doing all this stuff, but you can see what I'm, what I'm working with here, so let's go, let's start shooting off these cars. Right off the bat we have what you've seen already, guys, um, the uh, Ventador, and uh, this is again one of my favorite castings for this uh this year, uh, thus far, we have the Faradox. I'm sorry. Faradox. Uh, don't know much about this car. Um, let's see. Maybe some of you guys know what, what it's all about. It's a track car, obviously. Metal base, um, plastic body. It's, you know, I'm not into these kinds of cars, but whatever. It is still kind of cool looking. Um, we have the Fast and Gassin, or Fast Gassin. Uh, weird colors. <laughs> um, I don't know what what's going on with uh, Hot Wheels. Another white uh, Grand Torino, but you guys have already seen this. Here we have the Nerve Hammer in um, neon orange. This is part of the Track Stars uh, series, X-Ray Racers or X Racers. This is a cool one. And that is the '64 Lincoln Continental. Um, this is part of the Graffiti Rides, I believe. Yeah, Graffiti Rides, as you can see right there. Um, and it's it's pretty cool. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't really like the blue wheels. <laughs> but I, I kind of like the blue wheels better than the red if I had to pick the two. So it's got a blue uh, uh, windshield. One good thing they did do is make the interior black, which is pretty cool. Um, we have the... 2012 Mini Countryman Rally uh, in red. This thing looks great. Um, pretty stoked about that. And there's two of them. So sorry about the glare, guys. It's uh, kind of last minute. Didn't have a chance to like look it over or fix my lighting. Uh, we have Arachno Rod. I'm not really a fan of the fantasy cars, but for those that are, there you go. Um, we have another. BMW 2002, very cool in blue, obviously. Uh, I love that car. Uh, we have a backslider, but this time in blue with yellow wheels. Um, let me put that that way. It's very cool, and uh, I like this car. Again with the phone. Sorry guys. Um, Another car, new uh, model that I haven't seen yet is the Ducati 1098R. Very, very, very cool. Uh, they've got these very clean tampos on there, and it's just an awesome bike. I love this. I love this one because it looks like something that you would definitely see on the road. Something that I'd actually buy. Um, another 2002. We have the BMW M3, but this time in black. It's kind of like a black metallic. Very cool. With a gray interior, or silver interior. Another blue black backslider. Another M3. Uh, this time we have the Tarmac, but in a turquoise with red uh, base. Now, a lot of people are like hit and miss with this car. I don't know what I'm if I like it or dislike it. I don't dislike it. Let's put it that way. Uh, Vendetta. 
Nothing new. I think this is just a repeat. Um, a Batman Live. Batmobile. Uh, they're reissuing them in F. Huh? Let's see. We got the 70 Chevelle SS Wagon. Uh, but you've seen that already. The Canyon Carver in red. Um, we've already seen the Nitro Door Slammer. And here's a weird, weird semi-psycho in really psychotic colors. <laughs> Blue, yellow, and orange. Kind of weird for me. I'm, again, I'm not a fan of those cars, but, you know, some of you guys are. Um, here is the Ferrari 458 Spider. Uh, another repeat, but still looks great. Mark, I think, Spanky Mark, you did a little, like, side-by-side -side comparison or something. Uh, so, here's to you. Another uh, Chevelle wagon. Bunch of repeats I'm seeing here. Uh, Porsche Carrera GT. Uh, here's one that's definitely not a repeat, and it's very cool. The 70 Buick GSX in red, with these very cool tampos uh, and gold rims. I like the fact that it's gold, and that they're not um, yellow. <laughs> All right, very very cool. Got another Chevelle SS X, -ra X Racers, uh, another 62 Chevy, another Volkswagen GTI in blue. Um, ooh, finally, here's another uh, Porsche Carrera GT. Finally, a new one. <laughs> this is very cool. This is the Combat Medic, but with the SWAT logos, tampos. Um, I'm going to buy a ton of these because... When I was a kid, I used to watch SWAT on TV, and it was like, da -da -da, da -da -da, da -da -da. I think that was the theme song. Um, and the van didn't look like this exactly, but it kind of rem reminds me of the TV show, so very cool SWAT. Um, the 70 Plymouth AR, double AAR Cuda. Uh, this car is badass. It's got some great Falcon tire tampos all over it. Um, the color schemes are right, and it, you know, the white painted rims actually pop, so it makes it looks, it looks really good. The combination's good. Um, the interior is black, which I really appreciate, and the base is dark gray, which is also plus. So we got another winner, another Aventador, always a winner in my book. Another ugh, super psycho, whatever psycho, um, semi psycho, and here's the swamp buggy. Um, again, I don't like these imagination cars, but the Swamp Buggy does look kind of cool because it has these uh, interesting tampos that make it look like maybe that it is a bug of some sort. Um, and yeah, just something interesting. Uh, for the kids, man, for the kids. Some more new cars, another Ferrari 458. An awesome yellow Enzo. Enzo Ferrari coming out in yellow. Definitely stoked about that. And now we have the custom Cadillac, Cadillac Fleetwood. This is the car that I've been waiting for. It's beautiful. I mean, really beautiful. I mean, look at look at the interior too. It's kind of kind of cool. Um, I'll do a quickie car review of this for sure. And let's see. Ah, yes. The Subaru WRX STI. Uh, Justin, I, Justin, I know you just did an unboxing video where you got these. Well, finally, I got them. <laughs> Great video, by the way. Great second video. Can't wait to see more of what you got coming up once you get a camera. Um, Diesel Boy. Yeah, not a fan, but whatever. It's, it's a cool little futuristic car. Might be able to do something with this, like, on a custom. So, we'll see. Another white uh, Gran Torino Sport. We have another Nitro Door Slammer. Um, okay, here is the Ford F-150. But this one does not have the cab cover. So I'm wondering, which is more rare? The one with the cab cover or the one without the cab cover? Um, in any event, I love this truck. Uh, if you want to know more about it, I have a quickie car review on this. So just look up F Ford F-150 on my channel, and you'll be able to see the quickie car review on that. Here is the Nova Station Wagon. That is also the new model, one of the new models for this case. It's very cool. 
And I love this. If I can find more, I will grab more. And look, asking ye shall receive. Got another one. Um, another swamp buggy. Meh. Here's a 69 Chevy in red. Very cool. I like this. I wish they would have done it in a metallic red. It would have been uh, much better for me. <laughs> um, another AAR Cuda. Uh, another Diesel Boy. Not so much a fan of that. And my first, or my second, thanks to Spanky Mark, who sent me my first Flintmobile. Uh, but here's my second Flintstones Flintmobile. Um, very cool. Awesome. Okay. I'm stoked about that. Um, awesome. Another Nova Station Wagon. Here's an, I don't know why I have another Diesel Boy. Um, maximum Leeway. I think this is also a new F case car. Uh, plastic body with a uh, metal base and it's a track star car so um ooh an awesome Cadillac Escalade 2007 in a very 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 cool paint job so I like these uh turquoise lined rims too they uh sort of match the pinstriping but very very cool can't wait to get more of those and I think this is a new model uh, for the F case um, another Buick GSX a Dakar in the new colorway for the team racing Hot Wheels uh, team Hot Wheels I mean I think this is for yellow driver right I, I've always liked the Dakar it's kind of had this kind of cool look to it too um, another Batmobile another Enzo Another 62 Chevy truck. Okay, what else do we got? With Scupa del Fuego. But this time it has a metallic red. Nice paint job. Don't really care about the car. Um, oh, yeah. Two different colored wheels, too. Um, we have a erroneously packed Scorpedo. Again, not a fan of these... Uh, Imagination cars, but there you go. 69 Chevy in red. Um, Alright, so I think here's another one that's Scorpedo's packed wrong. <laughs> um, I think these are part of the new F case. And these are the 24 hours. And they're in white. Um, plastic body. Metal base. And uh, the Hot Wheels Racing decor. Um, let's see. Another one of these uh, Subarus. I love those things. The Super Snake. Too bad it's not a Super Snake. <laughs> Another white 2013 Ford GT, which is uh, part of the E case. Another Dakar. Another Maximum Leeway. And last and not least, the Aston Martin DBS in white. Um, sadly, no treasure hunts at all. Not even a super, not even a regular. So, um, there you have it. Here's my F case unboxing video. If you like what you saw, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, leave any questions, comments down below. And thanks again for watching, guys. Um, again, I'm sorry I've been gone missing in action. It's just because I've been sick. So, and I'm probably still sick. So, <laughs> anyways, thanks again for watching. And, um, keep your eye open for my next video, which will probably be very cool because it's not Hot Wheels related. Um, and it's very, very cool toy related. So thanks guys. Bye.